you broke the color barrier on network TV in the right in the 1950. Yeah, for a, a long time, but uh, you know, some what people had. What was that like? Was that? A, well, it was, it was beautiful for me. You know, it was. Was, a, uh, was, was, it, a, was there a lot of resistance, or what would you? Well, the there was. Yeah, there was of. Uh, well. The way it started, the Urban League was doing inquiries into all the major industries as to why there was not more black representation in the industry. And they went to NBC, and they were told NBC told them there were no black musicians that could play music on television. So they didn't believe it. So they made up uh, questionnaires and sent them all about, all about. And my name happened to come back on a lot of them. So they called me to to the, they got the hold of Aaron Levine, who was contractor of NBC. And he, uh, but they persuaded him that he had to have uh, uh, at least one black person. Well, that, there was there was some hidden resentment, you know, just yeah. like there still is in the South, you know. Right, right. You know, yeah. Some people try to adhere to the law and the rules, but uh, there's some who still want to do it their way, you know.